Hi, uh, I hope you guys had a, a good weekend. So let's uh, have some idea about what we are going to cover in this week. So this is our week five and uh, we want to wrap up our exploratory data analysis journey that we are doing for last uh, two weeks and um, we will also uh, kick off our uh, project you know so uh, let's look at the overview uh, so as i mentioned that we'll be wrapping up our exploratory data analysis journey and um, we will cover some of the categorical data uh, handling techniques uh, then um, we will review uh, some projects done by previous kdd students so you guys have some idea that how a good project look like okay uh, i encourage you guys to start discussing among yourselves uh, about your project topic that you have recorded in the shared drive google document uh, try to narrow down the scope um, and start collecting some data you know so to start with uh, not quote, quote unquote this will be your final data um, but uh, we we want you to start sooner than later uh, so we guys can give you proper feedback you know so starting from next week uh, we will be doing a 45 minutes uh, one to one project meeting with each of the group this will be based on your survey response so you guys will receive some meeting requests and again uh, we will be meeting uh, uh, once in every two weeks okay so we will have maybe three four meetings uh, in total uh, as we finish the project okay one thing is also due this week is your second uh, homework assignment so it is going to be due on uh, 26th of september thursday uh, 11 59 pm so keep your eyes open so you don't miss the deadline okay so this is the overview so in terms of reading materials what i have done um, so let's first go to the notebook so in the notebook section you will find one project done by previous 635 students so uh, you can uh, run this notebook uh, by taking a copy at your google space um, uh, this uh, notebook is uh, self-explanatory and uh, you uh, to get some idea about how uh, a, a good or successful project look like okay regarding reading list so i have um, added uh, the description of that project that I just mentioned because these guys actually wrote a paper. Again, although we have a um, reporting as part of this project, but uh, you guys need to not write a formal paper for sure. This is only for interested students. They want to actually take that project uh, after the, the course. But uh, this uh, paper will give you uh, more information about the notebook so that's why i added this in your reading list chapter 5 handling uh, categorical data from this uh, machine learning with python cookbook uh, that we have uh, access through online okay and uh, we'll be also covering part of the probability basics from uh, this book pattern recognition and machine learning by bishop uh, you just need to focus on section 1.2.1 okay um, I have already talked about the notebook uh, part and then as uh, always we'll be posting the uh, slides by the end of this week okay